Hello and welcome to HITC Sport. If that Jamie Vardy movie ever gets made, do you think they'll leave in that chapter where he reverts back to a player who can barely get a kick in the Premier League? After his whirlwind season last year, Vardy has scored in just three games. What's gone wrong with him? Jamie Vardy, what, what's gone wrong there? Nothing. Huh? I don't think he's getting quite the service. He's not getting the same service. He's just not getting the service. The service isn't happening. In the service. I think it's the service. He's not got the service from Kante this season. He's not really getting the service this year. No supply. His form hasn't tailed off. It's the fact that he's not getting the same sort of supply as he's had in the previous last two or three seasons. How do you score if you get the ball up to him? He's not being given the space. The one team that gave him the space, he got a hip trick against Man City. Danny Drinkwater is not stringing the passes to him like he did last year. The other teams are him back and not letting him run past him. He'll still pop up. He'll still score another 10 goals this season and keep us up. Okay. Isn't that just that he's a one season wonder? Two victory feats. He broke the record and then he thought, I don't need to try anymore. I think, I think his marriage can be questioned about that as well and his, uh, his, wife's, his wife's not his favourite. Uh, You're not a fan of Rebecca? No, not particularly. I don't think he's a one season wonder because he scores goals. I know it's lower league clubs, but they were double figures every time. That was a brilliant season, you know, but um, I don't expect it to happen again sometime soon. Ah, yeah. so yes. Uh, but, but one season wonder. Did you hear regrets not getting his move to Arsenal? You know he's stuck here in a small little town. He turned it down, not us. He's taking a lot of money from the club now and what's he got to achieve now? I, mean, I think possibly it would have been better for him to have moved, yeah. But he's probably thinking, what if? Yes. Yeah. No. Every day, of course he does. He will. I Every think day he's of the year, yeah, but he's only here for Kante's one. laughing his head off. He won't get played off. Kante is laughing. And I'd go on what would have happened. He'd probably be getting slaughtered on Arsenal fan TV. He's, he's really proved himself that he wants to remain with this team. If I hadn't been for Leicester, he wouldn't be where he is today. Mares, perhaps, he's the one that perhaps ought to have moved on for himself. But then again, they're getting the money, aren't they? Do you think his England career is dead? No, uh, he'll still be in the squad. Who else is there? The story's even worse, isn't it? Danny Ings is going to come back from injury soon. Danny Ings. Would you sell him in the summer? Get a bit of cash from him. What, what would you do? Well, depends on how much is money. I don't know. Uh, I'd offer you about 20 quid. Maybe a packet of crisps as well. Yeah. <laughs> Want a bit more than that. You're going to sell a 30 year old who would have scored, what, less than, let's say, a dozen goals in the season. What are you going to get for him? Well, and who's going to pay 100,000 a week for him or whatever he's on? He's a true Leicester man through and through. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.